I'm Ruth Carter. I was the costume designer on Black Panther. What happens now determines what happens to the rest of the world. After two Oscar nominations, people look to you for doing these biopics, and they think that you are, you know, only wanting to do that, which is quite the contrary. <laughs> the Black Panther, that's huge. You know, the following, the fans, the responsibility. If the world found out what we possess, we could lose our way of life. What do you want? I love dressing the people of Wakanda. I had so much fun infusing some traditional African pieces with modern society. We took the Maasai tribe, the color of the Maasai tribe, which is bright reds and yellows, beautiful colors, and I brought the color up. And I also added beadwork to the tabard. I chevroned the patterns and beads on that tabard so it would look like something that could be passed on and passed down. My son, it is your time. Queen Ramonda's wearing her shoulder piece, which I call her mantle. We printed this through uh, the process of 3D printing. I designed it to have the look of African lace. Zuri's costume was one of the last ones to be built. As he stands in front of the fall, the strips are blowing. There was probably a thousand of them on this costume. I have great things to show you. It is lighter and completely bulletproof. Now, Shiri, his little sister, has designed him this new suit. It had to be thinner, much more sleek. So from a wide shot, it looked like a solid. Going in, you could actually see this fantastic texture. I think when people look at the costumes of the Black Panther, they're going to see so many elements that they're going to just be saying, oh, wow look at any frame and there's something to learn, there's something to react to. I knew that, you know, this is a film medium where we get in close and we could see details and textures. It's a feast for the eyes.